Yo, what is up everyone? Welcome back to another video. Anyways, in this video we're going to be talking about the new um, dice event that is rolled around because there's some stuff in here that they added that I don't really agree with everything, but, you know, let's go ahead and get into it. Anyways, new shining headwear off the rip. Um, the first thing I'll say about this is probably it's the most, it's the best visual headwear in the game, in my opinion. Um, but, um, it's actually the new best shoddy headwear, which I'll probably break down in another video, but yeah. Um, Star Crown headwear is here, so, yeah, there's three shiny headwear to choose from now, but I would say that each, each time they only get a little bit better, but I'll explain why in another video. Anyways, this is new, I believe. Divine, actually, I don't even know if this is new. I just know the Guardian is new. Let's go to the Guardian first, actually. Divine Era Envoy is now in the dice shop for two silver coins. Um, I hate this for many reasons. Um, to break it down, this Guardian literally started off as a free-to-play Guardian. So, um, where is it? I forget where you buy these things at. I just know you buy them with shells. Oh, I, I missed it. Anyways, here we are. So there's a selection box with Divine Air Envoy shards in it. So you can only get this Guardian. For, it, it released free-to-play. Not even get it free-to-play. It's re just a release free-to-play. So I don't like the, the notion that they're making a Guardian that released as originally a free-to-play Guardian um, for two silver coins. Because not only is that, like, annoying in its own right, it's just kind of dumb. But on top of that, well, the roulette isn't here anymore. But during roulette, you can actually um, redeem three of those shards for the fat stars, the fat yellow stars, uh, which are, they're not free to play, but they're very cheap overall. And you, a lot of people end up with extras of those. I don't know what to do with them. So someone like me might redeem Divine Air Envoy shards to get, to get those, um, to build it up over time, you know. So, honestly, I am really just not the biggest fan of Divine Air Envoy in DICE at all. And I don't know why they're gatekeeping Sakura Envoy, because it's literally like they just hate money right now. If you just put Sakura Envoy in the mar in the DICE shop, people will spin DICE because Sakura Envoy is one of the most anticipated DICE Guardians in the game. We've been waiting for it for f um, since, like, Butterfly got released. Because at this point in the game, everyone has a Butterfly, but everyone is kind of just waiting for Sakura Envoy. So, like, it's kind of dumb when we're waiting for that, but they're not releasing it. And then instead of the releasing Soccer Envoy, they released Divine Air Envoy. So, yeah. I don't know if the book is new for a gold coin, but I don't. I shouldn't have to be the one to tell you this. You guys should already know by now. Do not buy this. Do not buy this, please. Um. Anyways, there's something else in DICE, I believe. Oh, the outfits in this dice are actually good this time. So here's the outfit. The mount's decent. But uh, the headwear is decent. I don't know. It's about average. I actually like this headwear, but I'm not going to get it. But I like it. Um, the steps are probably my favorite steps in the game. But um, I don't buy steps, especially something that adds visual clutter. But I mean, if I get it, you know, I'd, be, I'd use it, obviously. But, um... I feel like there was something else that they added in dice that I didn't like, but I, I can't really remember. Well, they've got these in dice. I don't know. Interesting. But yeah, that's not bad overall. Um, and then going down, music books, since they've all been released, nothing changed about these things. Um, but I wouldn't really recommend if you're a DPS getting anything other than the DPS one. I think there's a couple books that I say you could get for a DPS that doesn't require uh, red books. Sorry guys, I'm a little bit tired, so I'm not reading these right. Here it is, Requiem score, Requiem. Um, this goes reflect rate 2%, which I go think goes up to like 6% or something. No, it probably goes like 10% max. So that's a good book to get. Um, and then the blue books, let's see. Um. Okay, I don't see any blue books that I would really deem as worth it, but other than that, you guys already know about the red books, but yeah. Dice, 
Um, it keeps upgrading, I guess. Well, quote unquote upgrading. I wouldn't call Divine Air Endpoint an upgrade. And yes, I'm a hater on it. I don't care. Um, get it free to play. But Dice keeps upgrading with the new crown. So, um, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.